Hello everyone, this is Afra from Quick WordPress Websites. Today we are going to see how to download Divi theme and install it and how to activate the API key and the license of Divi theme for a lifetime. Then we will see how to import the Divi library layouts and create a website. Divi theme and Divi builder is developed by Elegant Themes. If you are a paid lifetime member, you can download directly from Elegant Themes. There are Divi theme and builder, Extra, Bloom and Monarch. So I am as a lifetime member, I am going to download this from the original Elegant Themes. You can buy same files to $3 from the link provided in the description. So we will provide you this mega link. Here you can click the item and download as a standard download. We will provide the API and license key for the lifetime. Please read the description for more details. Let's install the DV theme. For that, log in to your WordPress dashboard click appearance and click themes then click add new please note divi come as divi theme and divi builder plugin if you install divi theme it will automatically install the divi builder plugin so no need to worry so i will add new click add new and upload theme and choose the file now i am locating the downloaded divi theme and click install now it will take around 2 to 5 minutes. Wait for that. Once it done, click activate. So the theme is activated. Now the DV icon will appear in the dashboard. So let's install the license key. So click DV and click theme options. Once it open the DV theme options, click updates. Here you have to copy paste the username and password provided. Once it's done, click save changes. So now the license key is activated. Let's open the website in a new tab and see. So this is the basic appearance once you install the DVT. So let's create new pages and new website using DV library layouts. For that, go to pages and click all pages. So first remove the unnecessary pages. So I just dash the available pages, sample page and other privacy page. So I have removed. So let's add a new page. So this new page will be the home page. So I will give the name as home. Then click use DV Builder. Now the DV Builder will open. It will ask three choices. One build from scratch. Another, another one is choose a pre-made layout. Another is clone existing page. So our choice is choose from pre-made layout so once you click that the library will be loaded so if you not install the username and api key it will ask here to install insert the username and api key so you have to install it i have opened a printing shop layout so there are seven pages so first i will select the landing page so here you can view the live demo and you can use this layout so first we will check the live demo so once we click it will open another tab and it will show you the display of the page so let's use this layout once you click it will load the layout so it will take few seconds to few a few minutes depending on your server and the internet speed once the page is fully loaded it will display the page to be edited so you can edit here or else you can save the publish the page and you can edit later so i'll show you the dv builder is very convenient so you can visually edit anything so i just show you you can edit any text visually and you can change the setup column and all the things you can visually set up so it will be uh, done in a different tutorials now let's publish the page let's open the website in the new tab and see see still the same default theme is here so there are two home pages once you click the next word only it will show the layout so how to set up this so go to the dashboard 
click appearance then click customize so the customizer will open go down and select home page settings here you have to set up the page the by default it is your latest post but you have to select a static page and you have to select the page home in capitals that is what we are installed the layout now publish now let's refresh and see the page hooray now you can see the home page is appearing but still you are having this uh, double home and uncategorized is there so how to set up this for that go back to the dashboard click appearance and click menus so in the menu you have to create a primary menu so i am creating a pri menu called primary menu select the display location as the primary menu and create menu now here you have to select the home page you have created and add and save menu now let's refresh our website and see hooray now only the default layout page we have created appearing now let's add other pages go to dashboard select pages and add new here i am going a title called services and click use with db builder again i am selecting choose a pre made layout go down to the print shop layout select services and use this layout now the services page is loaded let's publish it similarly i have added shop and about us pages to display them in the front page go to menus and you can select those pages about us and shop and add to menu and if you want you can rearrange the menu items so i am bringing the services above so if you want to automatically update the pages just click automatic so once you click automatic if you add a new page it will automatically update it into the menu item if you want to change the site logo go to dv click theme options and here you can find the logo and you can upload your one finally in each pages you can see there are some footer unnecessary footer appearing so if you want to remove this footer go to dashboard then appearance then click widgets so in the widgets you can see the sidebar widgets and footer widgets so let's minimize this and you, you can go to the footer area one here the foot items are available so just open it and you can remove all the foot items if you don't want so click here and remove heading similarly other things you can remove so one by one you can remove so once you completed you can refresh your website and see that the footer will not appear thank you very much